Okay, hey everyone, welcome back to Crypto Minute. My name is Mark Borden, and I'm going to tell you how to make some life changing money. But we need to explain a few things first, like what is cryptocurrency? What's all the fascination about cryptocurrency? So, we're going to take a little bit of focus on the granddaddy of them all, Bitcoin. And if you've ever wondered what all the buzz is about, stick around for the next two minutes. So I'm going to break everything down for you. Imagine a digital revolution where traditional currencies meet the power of technologies. That's where cryptocurrencies come in. Simply put, it's a form of digital or virtual currency that uses cryptography for security. Unlike traditional currencies that are backed by the government, okay, and we know what governments do with our money, they continue to spend it and we see inflation keep going up. Cryptocurrencies operate on a decentralized network based on blockchain technology. Basically, there's little nodes that are on um, that we're trying to fill and it's a computational program. I am mining Bitcoin right now. I will show you some of those profits later. Um, but we'll get back into that and do a, a couple later videos. All right. So what's this blockchain everyone's talking about? Think of it as a secure, transparent ledger that records all transactions across a network of computers. Now, each transition is a basically, or transaction is a block, and these blocks are all linked together in a chain that create a tamper-resistant record of every transaction. The decentralized nature means that no single entity has control, making it much more secure and resistant to fraud. Okay, the trailblazer of cryptocurrencies was created in 2009 by an unknown person, there are some speculations, uh, by the name of Satoshi Nakamoto. Now, Bitcoin was designed as a peer-to-peer -peer electronic cash system. Unlike traditional currencies, there's a fixed supply of 21 million Bitcoins, adding an element of scarcity. But where do Bitcoins come from? Well, that's where mining comes into play. Now, mining involves solving complex mathematical puzzles, and miners are rewarded with new Bitcoins for their efforts. This process not only creates new Bitcoins, but also verifies and secures transactions on the network. Okay, so what's the point of all this? What are cryptocurrencies, especially Bitcoin, offering several benefits? Okay, they're faster, they're cheaper cross-border transactions that provide financial inclusion for the unbanked and offer a hedge against inflation. Some even see them as digital gold, okay, and a store of value in times of economic uncertainty. Okay, so there you have it in a whirlwind of cryptocurrency and Bitcoin. It's a dynamic and evolving space with lots to explore. And if you found this overview helpful, give us a thumbs up. Consider liking this. Um, I'm going to have a basically 80-part series on investing in cryptocurrency. This is just the very beginning of it. I will put these out uh, for the public to see, but eventually they're going to be into a course um, for all of you. So... Stay curious, stay informed, and we'll catch you in the next one. And as always, God bless you.